So the Instagram followers checker lets you analyze your Instagram data and view your statistics. And one of those statistics is the fact that you can check who doesn't follow you back. We all know how that feels. So let's go ahead and download our Instagram data. So what you can do is press this button here. Now, generally on a mobile device, it'll bring you to the Instagram app. If you're on a browser on a desktop, it should bring you to this location here, but let's assume it's brought us to Instagram. So what we need to do is go all the way back, go to our profile and go into our settings, then go to account center, scroll down, go to your information, download your information, and if we take a look, you can see it's the exact same. Now, the next thing you need to do is download or transfer, then select the Instagram account, then click on next, and then select some of your information. And then what we can do here is search for followers or following, or you can just scroll down to where it says connections, and you can select it here and click on next, then download to your device. And in this section here, in the date range, what you want to do is select all time, especially if it's your first time doing this and then save. Now, when it comes to the notification, I do recommend you use the same email as the account. And then the most important part is selecting the format as JSON or JSON, whichever way you prefer to say that. And for the media quality, it doesn't really matter. You can pick the lowest if you like, and then we can create the file. So you can see it's now in progress here. This is the latest one that I've just generated, but for the sake of this video, we'll just click download here. And what it's gonna do is ask you for your password, and then this will download the zip file. As you can see, there's a couple of them here. So we'll take this first one and then we'll extract it. And you can see here, these are all the files that come in that zip. The important ones are followers underscore one dot JSON and following dot JSON. We can now go down here and we can select that file. So just to show you how it looks like, we'll go connections, followers and following, and we'll select the followers underscore one dot JSON. Now we'll do that for the following as well. And now we can analyze and you can see it gives you this information here. So this is the total following and then the people not following us back and then the people we don't follow back and you have your total followers, which basically is total following minus not following back plus people I don't follow back. So the bread and butter of all of this is this section here. We can see all the users and we can select them. And you can see it opens up on Instagram. Now, if we check their following, you should see that I'm not on this list. However, I'm in their followers list if this will just load. As you can see, there's my business account. So this obviously indicates there's not a mutual follow and what we can do is just go ahead and unfollow this user. So if we go back to the app, we still have other options as well. As you can see, we can check the people we don't follow and our mutual follows. So yeah, that is really the main part of it. Just another tip as well you can add this to your home screen and install it. So if we go here, you should see that installing in just a second. And there you go, KCC IG Checker app installed. Now I've designed this to be fully responsive and obviously like a mobile app itself. It's really handy. You can just have it on your home screen and go ahead and do the exact same here. But yeah, that's really it. Please also don't forget to support the app. It really helps me out in terms of maintaining this and keeping it running and live for all of you. Anyway, thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, please reach out to me.